Welcome to the countdown. Today, we're counting down our picks for the top 10 best anime moments. For this list, we'll be looking at the most iconic and epic scenes in anime shonen that left us mind blown. Number 10, Escanor and Estorosa, Stare Down, Seven Deadly Sins. Sometimes the lead up to a battle is so well placed that it actually eclipses the brawl that follows, as was the case when the lion sin of pride took on the commandment of love. But I told you, your death wasn't going to be an easy one. Cruel son! With his broken ability to freeze those who feel hate towards him, Estorosa easily brings the majority of the sins to their knees. Except for Escanor, that is. As it happens, his pride in himself is so great that all he feels towards his opponents is pity, thus negating the commandment and setting the stage for his infamous duel. And now for cruel son, I will be the one to decide. Die. Number 9. Serious Punch Turns out when Saitama puts a little bit of effort, there's nothing that can stop him. That's the way, Saitama. You are indeed worth the effort. Consecutive normal punches. As the alien Tyrone Boros continues to shift into more uncontrollable forms, the hero for fun decides now would be a great time to put in a little elbow grease into his swings. For the first time, we see Saitama get serious with one of his punches, an attack that not only finishes Boros with a single punch, but might have shattered the ozone layer as well. Knowing fully well he was still holding himself back just makes the fact all the more dazzling to behold. Number 8. Asta takes Yami's sword. This one-on-two -on -two battle against the formidable leader of the Dark Triad, Dante, is one of the purest examples of flashy action done right, showcasing Yami and Asta's unwavering determination and willpower as they try to contend with Dante's devilish magic. What really pushed it to the shonen peak was the moment Yami willingly handed over his beloved katana to his fellow Black Bull, symbolizing his respect and trust for the no magic loser. We couldn't ask for a more beautiful, brutal way to display such an exhilarating fight. Number seven, Ultra Instinct, Dragon Ball Super. Capturing the excitement of hardcore fans, blinding casuals with exquisite animation, all the while increasing the franchise's love in a way that hasn't resonated so broadly since the original Super Saiyan transformation. It's fair to say Goku's mastering of Ultra Instinct was a huge blast. After awakening these powers only known to the gods, Goku is able to match the power of Jiren, leading to a one-sided beatdown that caused fans to lose their minds. It wasn't only epic, it was also a masterpiece. Number 6. United States of Smash, My Hero Academia. I know the end of All Might may have been painful, but it was also the most glorious goodbye anyone could hope for. Now, it's your turn. Pushing his abilities past their limits, the world's greatest hero burned through the last embers of his quirk just for the small chance he could come back from the brink and reclaim his victory. Even as his body broke down, All Might held strong to the teachings of his predecessors, allowing him to land his final technique. And it's really hard to bounce back after taking a full country to the face. Stand up! 
Number 5. Slayers vs. Daki and Gutaro, Demon Slayer. With not just one, but two demons to take down, Demon Slayer brought out all the stops for an epic, internet-melting climax. Although at this point we shouldn't be surprised, after all, there are more epic moments in one episode than most series get in a whole season. You've got Inosuke's clutch entrance, Tanjiro growing his mark, Tengen's flashy moves, and so much more, all combining into an intriguing finisher that's guaranteed to make our jaws drop. Number 4. Infinite Void. Jujutsu Kaisen. It is hard to tell what's most exciting here. Gojo showcasing his control over the concept of infinity, or the infuriating beauty of those eyes he's got tucked away behind. Infinite Void. Both moments came to a head during his battle with the high-level curse, Jogo, where the sorcerer saw fit to reveal his own domain expansion, which not only won him the battle in an instant, but also revealed just how OP Gojo really is. How do you contend with a man that bends space and time at will? Number 3. Madara destroys the Shinobi Alliance, Naruto Shippuden. There has been a colossal amount of buildup regarding this mythical ninja. So many stories of the infamous Uchiha and his unmatched brutality. Yeah. Turns out all of them were true. Moments after being reanimated, Madara decides to show the new generation just how intense his warm-ups could get as he takes on the entire Shinobi army single-handedly and wipes the floor with them. It is so majestic in how Madara easily overpowers every foe that comes his way, even at half strength. And that's all before he decides to drop a pair of meteors on them. Number 2. Luffy Awakens. One Piece. It took us a while, but finally, One Piece had to attain such an epic and unforgettable milestone. After being pushed to the brink of death during his fight with Kaido, Luffy makes an unexpected comeback thanks to the power of his newly awakened Devil Fruit. With the true nature of his Devil Fruit finally unleashed, Luffy kicks into fifth gear and goes all out against Kaido. With an awakening as a result of joy, granting him the freedom to do whatever he pleases, Luffy manipulates his environment along with Kaido himself and trashes the clown with attacks straight out of a comical manga. With the sight of freedom at his grasp, Luffy uses the world's most ridiculous power to put an end to Kaido's reign of tyranny once and for all. Number 1. Naruto and Sasuke vs. Momoshiki, Boruto. Leave it to our guys to come out of semi-retirement, duo once again, and ride practically everything this sequel has done so far. Despite facing the ominous wrath of an Atsutsuki in his ultimate form, he wasn't really prepared for just how powerful these two frenemies can get. With Sasuke's dual wielding of the Sharingan and Rinnegan, combining with Naruto's Six Paths and Tailed Beast, they quickly turn the tide of battle with a full display of perfect and undeniable teamwork. I guess we should all just ignore the whole part of Boruto being the one to land the final killing blow. What battles or scenes do you find most intriguing? Write your thoughts in the comments. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe for more exciting content.